then do you get very much involved with each production so do you get to know people personally and are you involved in every single step of the way yes um because i'm a yeah no. <laughs> um no that's not true at all i think i think what's very important a very important part of producing is finally picking the right team and then letting them do the job you've hired them for so i don't micromanage i, I would like to think i don't micromanage i'm very involved in casting but that's also because I'm a casting director. Um, I'm very involved in obviously choosing the creative team. Um, I'm I want to be to have final sign off on the set design, those sorts of things. But if I've hired a good set designer and my director and they get on, it's not my job. That, they've got to create the piece. My job is to pay for it and sell it. Mm -hmm. Now it helps if I love it and I want to be part of it because that's my creative burn for doing it. But um, I think it's. I think it's. I think you have to let people do their job. So, for instance, in a rehearsal process, I'll be there on the first day. I'll probably at the end of week one take the everyone out for a drink, say thank you for the week one. But then I won't be in until they start running it in week three or four because the last thing they need is the boss sitting there yeah. with their eagle eyes on them. You know, they need to be able to create and they need to be able to be free. So, so I'll be at every production meeting. I'll be at important run throughs, um, and obviously throughout tech and all the rest of it, I'll be there. But but no, you've got to let people do their job. And if I've done my job well, which is hiring the right people, I have to trust them to do their job. Mm -hmm. And there is this very, very big thing right now about mental health mm. and all that. And I, are you of the opinion that it has always been like that, but people are more open to talk about it now and to assume that they are suffering from something? Or do you think that the world is now creating more anxious people and people are just more prone to it because of all the stress. I think it's a bit of both. I think life is harder and every day gets harder. Um, but I also think we are more aware and we are better at giving things names and not brushing things under the carpet. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it's really interesting talking about Alzheimer's disease. My, my father has dementia. Um, and he says, you know, like he said, we were on the phone and Skype, he was in Australia, we were on Skype the other day and he said, he said, you know, it's ridiculous. You know, nobody had this a hundred years ago. It's like, no, but nobody was alive at 75 years old a hundred years ago. Mm -hmm. That doesn't mean to say it wouldn't have happened. It's just, you know, you're, we, we have learned how to, to control our bodies and, mm -hmm. and look after our bodies medically. No idea what goes on up there. Yeah. So I think, I think we are more aware of, and we're, we're better at, better, we're getting better at talking about it. I think it's still a long way to go. And um, so I certainly don't think this is a new phenomenon, mm -hmm. but I do think, um, I do think we, life is harder. You know, money is harder. There's too many people in the industry. There's, there's just lots of things that make it more complicated as well. As a producer, do you do you feel like it should always it should also be in your bag of tricks to help people out? They could reach out to you, or you could absolutely. I mean, I I, I hope that I that <laughs> we run a very open, inclusive, collaborative rehearsal room and run during the show. Um, I, I make it very clear. So on a lot of my smaller shows, we won't have a company manager, and that will be me. So, you know, and I do like to get to know people. I don't want anyone to ever feel that my door isn't open and they can't come and talk to me. Um, a lot of what I do revolves around, and this sounds, I was going to say revolves around alcohol, that makes me sound terrible. <laughs> but when I'm putting a team together, it's, yes, their talent is important, and yes, the ability to do the job, but also I want a bunch of people I want to go and spend time with, yeah. because we're creating a family. Um, so I would like to think that there is, there has to be a healthy divide between, you know, I'm not their friend and can't become their friend because otherwise um, the hierarchy breaks down. But I would like to think that no one would feel nervous about coming yeah. to talk to me about it. There has to be that trust. Of course. Mm -hmm. Of course. Mm -hmm. And I think that's a premise for life. I don't think that's anything to do with our industry. Mm -hmm. I just think the difference in our industry is we get to a closer point much more quickly. 